According to the leader of the NDC, John Mahama, the founder of the party, late Jerry John Rollins, discovered the community during his spraying of rivers in the area to tackle river blindness. He says since then, the NDC has been making frantic efforts to develop the community with the provision of basic amenities. However, the Yagabaku Bori constituency still lacks better roads, access to potable water, electricity, health facilities, markets and schools. According to residents, the expectation of the NDC is to focus on addressing these challenges if it wins the impending polls. We know if NDC comes to power, we know there is a lot of things they will do in this our just Ghana and then this our district. Because they started some, we see the, the beginning. But when they lose in power, nobody has when they become they did no Probably anything. I expect them to improve quality education in the rest. And then we should get our rules and the, the bridges that are remaining uncompleted to be completed. And that's my issue. And then they will get more jobs for us to get access to. And we also get more advantage and then advantage of the existing So that when they come to power, they pick only. The NDC Regional Secretary of the Northeast Region, Ibrahim Tia, tells City News the party has achieved a lot for the region. Free healthcare is one of the challenges that we want to address. Aside of the, 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 the free healthcare, the SHS, we want to add up a lot of infrastructure so that we eliminate the traffic system that they are implementing currently in the secondary schools. Thirdly, we want to expand the irrigation projects here. This place is an endowed area for farming. And as we are coming, you can see the vast lands. So we want to improve upon the agricultural sector to improve on the livelihoods of the people here. In a community engagement at Logre in the Yagabakubori constituency, John Mahama urged them to re-elect the NDC for more development.